How to change command key on Mac if you are using MacBook Air or MacBook Pro, the process is going to be same. Now there are multiple keys on your MacBook keyboard uh, for which you can change the functionality. Now for example, if I open notepad over here and if I select this whole line and if I press command plus C on my keyboard, what it will do is it will copy that particular line and if I press command plus V, it will paste the same line which we have copied. Now. On my keyboard, if I press the function key or the globe key once, it will activate the uh, emoji tab over here. So I can change the functionality of keys. And for that, uh, all we need to do is you can just simply go in system settings, which you can find in dock or else go and select Apple logo at the top and then select system settings. Now, once you open settings page, go down on the left, uh, left hand side and select keyboard option over here. And once you get all these options in that search for keyboard shortcuts, select keyboard shortcuts. And on this particular window, look for modifier keys. So select modify keys. And over here, you get all the options of the keys for which you can change the functionality. Now you have caps lock control option command key and the uh, and the globe key. Now in front of each key, you will find their uh, default functionality. Now caps lock will perform as caps lock, control will perform as control. You can basically reassign these functions or you can change it completely. Now, as I showed you with command key, I can simply copy any text or anything. And if I press command tab, I will be able to switch between applications. So if I want to assign the command functionality to any other key, let's say if I want to assign a command functionality to globe key, then select the uh, drop down in front of globe key and select command over here. Now you can see with globe key, I can do the command functionality. So if I go to notepad once again, this time instead of pressing command key, I'm going to press globe key and I'm uh, going to press C. So globe and C, I have copied the text. And if I want to paste it, uh, this time I'm going to press globe plus V. So it is going to paste that particular line. and. Uh, now, as I told you, uh, with with a single press of globe key on my uh, particular keyboard, it will activate uh, emoji tab. But now it is not happening because we have changed the functionality. So let's assign command key uh, to globe functionality over here. And if I go back to notepad, this time if I press command key once, it will activate the emoji tab. So yeah, this is how you can simply change the functionality of keys. And for uh, one key, if you don't want to use it, so let's say if I don't want to use globe key, I'm going to select this drop down and I'm going to select no action. So this is the basic settings you can do and you can change it for option and control key as well. You can just select the drop down and you can select whichever function you want. Now, one more thing. Uh, if you don't want to use it uh, whenever you have done the setting, whenever we ha uh, you have revamped the functionality and later on you don't want to use it anymore, you can always select restore default option over here and it will uh, get back to the default uh, functions which was present earlier. So yeah, this is how simple it is to change command key or basically you can change functionality of keys in your Mac. Uh, I hope this video was helpful. If it was, then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.